What is going on? KG4 NWE. I want to show you very quickly how to set up the PyStar remote in your uh, in your your radio. I'm using a uh, MMDVM it runs PyStar and so we'll just get right to it. You go to configuration you put in your password um, I can't remember my password but I think it is uh, that okay that must have been it okay expert mode is where we're going now PyStar remote right here can you see that right there PyStar remote it's right up there ish okay so the PyStar remote config file let me blow this up where you can see it better alright now look um, I should have put my monitor over here but anyway so uh, so you're gonna these little hashy mark things these little hashy things right here these you would take off um, so I'm gonna enable this like this enabled equals true Call sign KG4 and WE, and then I go down here, and these all really do the same thing. So I just use the DMR one, uh, service start and reboot, and that that's really that's really it. That's really it's all of it. There's nothing else to do there. Um, my DMR gateway is enabled because I have two time slots and uh, I just want to check that real quick while we were here sorry about that so I go to my dashboard then I go to my radio so I go to my radio I'm gonna hit uh, uh, where am I going okay so I'm gonna go to um, I added in my talk group list I added a bunch of different talk groups that I actually didn't make channels for but in the list uh, I have PyStar Reboot oh boy you can't see that because it's green and the okay anyway so PyStar Reboot so I'm gonna key it up alright let's see what she says and it should come back access and, code declined it says access code declined give me one second I'll be right back It says access code declined, but in my hotspot I have a, uh, wow, <laughs> anyway, I have a N05 hotspot, N5, N0, N5 BOC hotspot, N5 BOC hotspot, so um, that's that, and uh, you see over here, there's a, uh, it's a repeater, actually, but anyway, it will reboot and uh, let's give it a minute MMDV in device starting that is uh, KG5 RKI's uh, little script that uh, MMDV and connected to server if you're a patron of his um, you can get that script from his patreon page Oh, my XLX server should connect. Link to XLX313A. And we're good to go. So I uh, just rebooted it. All I did was key it up. And uh, that's pretty much it. I'm going to try to do that again. Mm, because it did say, like, uh, it did say you know access denied but even though it said that it worked so I'm not sure if that is like I don't know why it does that but it, it does work so the uh... looks like it's rebooting it didn't say anything that time but uh... 
it is definitely rebooting. So that's how you do that. It's configuration, which is not going to work right now because it's rebooting. Um, so that that is that. In case you wanted to know. Uh oh. Oh boy. So it's it's rebooting right now. There's another way of doing this, and if you go to your terminal, if you have a terminal, SSH. There, there it goes. It's working now. So we're gonna SSH a little bit into Pi. Uh, one, two, one, six, eight, one, two, nine. Oh boy, got all kind of issues here. So let's key in that, and then we'll do it again. Link two x l x three one three a. There we go. Yes, and then my password. Is right there, and now, uh, oh. what's my password? Oh, it's not nine nine. That's why. Gosh, I'm trying to get into something else completely different here. I don't know what I was trying to do there. I was I was trying to get into um, another Raspberry on my network. Is the dad gum? Mm. Maybe I just don't remember the password. Oh. Oh, it's not. It's Pastar. That's why. Uh, whoopsie daisy. Okay, so now we got it. So we're here, and um, well, um. It's, it's just one of those things, you know. But anyway, the uh, method to the madness here was to get this to work. So you go to configuration, PyStar, password, um, in DMR mode. You want to take a look at my stuff? Yes, I'm using Mexico and Brandmeister because I don't use Brandmeister. I use uh, TGIF. And the way I have it set up in the DMR gateway, I use TGIF. Anyway, expert mode. Uh, Pi-Star remote right here. And you would uh, here in this section, you need to put true up there and then put your call sign up there okay and then um, any of these that you want to use that have a hash mark a little pound sign like on DMR if it looked like this it wouldn't work at all see these have the hash marks right here it's not gonna work so you uh, erase the hash marks by the ones you want and if you want to shut it down erase the shut down one not a big deal hit apply changes and you are good to go so there's that hope that helps KG Vorton WE